Hey Taurus, how are we doing live? It'll be a love reading for you. It's gonna. I'm gonna check on your external energy. So whoever, the external energy around you regarding love, okay? Your external energy around you regarding love, romantic love, Taurus. What you need to know. Or what you wanna know. Maybe not need to know, but wanna know. You know what I'm saying, why not? No, you ain't. Well, I'm not going to say you. No, absolutely not. This is your external energy. Taurus, I could be reading for a dude. Uh, uh. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah. Yeah. Unreal. Taurus. What? Oh, no. I mean, listen, I'm about to explain. I'm sorry to, yeah. Mm -mm. Taurus, uh, your external energy love life. Who's doing the witchy pool black magic bullshit on you, dude? Yes. Yeah. I don't know if you know it or not, but it's happening. It's happening, Captain. This has been um, happening more frequently in my readings. <clears throat> Yes. Yeah. Yeah. This person's very concerned with getting the upper hand, uh, looking for a shortcut. Uh, this person wants to win and win at all cost. This person's willing to put the work in and then some. They're willing to pay for work to be done, son. Uh, son in reverse. Son, this person's a miserable mofo without you. Without you. So, they have contacted a magician, straight up. This magician has ensured their emotional happiness because this person said that that's paying for this. You see what I'm saying? My, my cards follow order. This person that's paying for this, there is a magician here that's promising great results. This person's willing to go to the ends of the earth for it as well. Whoever's paying for the work is extremely miserable. It's not in reverse. Um, definitely could be a baby mother. Someone who feels like a divine. Also, this magician that they're working with, the magician, waiting, the magician, they're waiting on results. This magician has guaranteed them through voodoo. Black, if it's not, I don't want to give voodoo a bad name. So let me say this. This is the black arts. This is divination abuse. This is someone that is has guaranteed that they will bend the will of another. They are going to guarantee that this other person, i.e. you, love them. That this person is absolutely coming in out of the cold. And that they will jump towards you. This is a ex. Absolutely, definitely could be a baby mother who is using, honey, the black arts. I'm not going to say voodoo. I don't want to give voodoo a bad name because I don't know enough about voodoo. Um, and I don't like to buy into the general theory that voodoo's awful. I think that guns are bad when used in the wrong way. I think that um, money is bad when used in the wrong way. So I don't want to put down the entire religion. You get what I'm saying? Voodoo just has a very neg negative connotation to it. Do I think that voodoo could be at play? Yes, I do. Am I going to narrow it down to that? No, I'm not. What I am going to tell you is this is black arts. 110%. 100, 250% this is black arts. Whoever's in your external energy, they have absolutely paid a magician. And this, this magician has 
agreed to work with them for a fee, small fee. It always starts small. I can't tell y'all enough. This magician most likely is overseas. They are a distance away from this other person. But this, this magician has guaranteed results. Uh, this person has just had to put up a small fee for this amount of work as well. Small fee. That's how it starts. Honey, uh, if I'm talking to a cross watcher, you know... I know when hearts are broken, shit get like this. When you deal with the black arts, okay, you realize that you're working with demonic energies. Do you think it's a one-time fee? That was, I, do you think you just bought a one-time fee? No, you bought into a regimen. You've bought into a regimen. With all things comes consistency. So do you think you just go get all this for whatever this person initially, even if they said no, no hidden charges, no hidden fees, baby. Well, yeah, because they're gonna give you the initial result. But as soon as something goes bad and that first hit is over, it's like smoking crack, like chasing the first hit. First hit's done, now what? Well, they, you know, life is constantly evolving. So when that doesn't, what are you doing, dude? You were that desperate. I'm not going to say that. I get it. I'm not placing judgment on the external party. What I will tell you, Taurus, as someone here, in your love, external love energy, whoever is meant for this message, there is absolute voodoo, hoodoo, black magic, and someone here is paying for it. Now, if it's going to be successful, I don't see that. Don't see it at all. I see that somebody here paid for some things and still miserable. Um... And now this person could be afraid. Okay. I mean, the sun's in reverse and the moon's upright, which tells me this person's miserable still. They're still waiting on results, and now they're kind of afraid. Now, why would that be? I know this shit is happening out there. And I know that it, it's been growing, I want to say, for the last five years. I, there's been a huge, huge amount of people invested in spirituality. Everybody's wearing beads now. It's much, it's grown. So, naturally, people want to take shortcuts. They're going to want to take shortcuts. I understand I don't agree with it because I'm old enough to know that there's no shortcuts. There's not only that, you cannot, God himself cannot make someone love you. It's the one thing God's not going to get involved in. He can't bend someone's will to love him. How the hell is he going to make you love somebody else? So, you know who you want to deal with for that. But, and the devil is here. It's here. Not these details. And the devil, ice cold with the shit. Um, somebody here was willing to do that because they were out in the cold. And they wanted to feel, they wanted to feel good again. I understand that. So, they went to the dark side. Okay? You know, it's like um, praying and all that. That is, the light side's just not working for me. Sun in reverse. So, I had to do something and I went dark. Okay. Okay. Ah, oh, hell. See? You know, shame on this magician. Shame. On this magician. Shame. But you know what? They're there to, you know, they're hired for a service. This is bullshit. Oh my God. Listen, Taurus, whoever you dealt with, you treated this Taurus 
I pray that your wife isn't listening to this. I pray that your husband isn't listening to this. I am talking to the Taurus I'm talking to, okay? You treated this person like a short-term fling, and I think it was. I think it was a short-term encounter, okay? Um, I do think that you have a family, soulmate. You have a soulmate here. You have a whole family, okay? But you had a little fun, passion, okay? Outside of the family. Then you cut this person off. Cut them off. So, Taurus... Um, probably talking to a dude. If not, I guess girls too. Maybe, I don't fucking know how people are anymore. I see somebody here who already has a soulmate and they already have a whole family. And there was some passion. There. Now, whoever this is. Why I'm saying shame on this magician. The magician knows that what the fuck this was. The magician knows this was a short-term thing. It was meant to be a fling. The magician knows that there was some type of soulmate here. But it was just for a short term, a short time. They also know that they're dealing with somebody here. That if they don't buy it from them, they're going to go buy it from someone else. So it's kind of like a drug dealer. You get what I'm saying? It's like, do I like poisoning the neighborhood? No. But if they don't buy it from me, they're just going to buy it from somebody else. And at least I know what I'm selling it isn't going to kill anybody. You get what I'm trying to say? You. This person's goal, um, this, this, uh, this magician has promised um, that there's going to be a divorce. I, they promised that you will divorce your spouse. I think you, yeah. Whoever, Taurus, I don't mean to call you out. You know, I hope to God that you're listening to this with your phones on. You definitely stepped out on your family. You had yourself a little fling. And now this person that you had this fling with, um, she's vindictive. This could also be your baby mother, honestly. This person feels like, you know, y'all have a family. Um, we weren't supposed to be short term. I wasn't supposed to be cut off. I wasn't supposed to be, you know what I mean? I'm your baby mother. Okay, girl. Okay, girl. I do feel like I'm talking to a dude. This feels like some female shit, some some shit, some female dude. They try to get try to get their baby daddy back. Plus, I got baby mama here. The only person I have up in here doing this shit is the Empress. With this devil. This person. Let me be clear. Let me clear my throat. Uh, ain't nobody gonna. <laughs> nobody is harming my throat chakra here. This person is waiting on magician results. You see that? They're waiting on magician results. And is definitely most likely a baby mother who played with the black arts. Um, this energy that they dealt with is very low vibing and it's very cold. It's fucking cutthroat. How cutthroat is it? I'm glad you asked. Um, it's so cutthroat. It's ice queen cold. That's what was verifying this. Okay. This some cold shit. Even though they tell you hell is hot. Um, hell is hot like uh, dry ice. That's how hot hell is. Hell is like dry ice hot. Can you picture freezing and, and burning at the same time? That's what hell is. And that's basically what I'm saying. It's dry ice hot. It's so fucking cold it burns your skin. That's what this person wants to play with. So before I sat down in your reading... Um, as I came through the door, they showed me the clip of Simba and his dad on the bridge. And Simba said, what's that shadowy place over there? And his dad said, 
but we don't ever go over there. That's the dark place. We never go there. And then there was the evil brother, Scar. For whatever reason, they really wanted to reiterate that. Okay. It's good. Anything else? We're going to wrap this up. I got like five minutes. Oh, no. I don't know. That's too many. I'll, I'll look at them. Somebody here is trying to bend the will to heavens. This person wants a complete family and they want it now. Not now, but right now. And they are trying to bend the will of the stars. They are definitely playing around with the stars. Yes, 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 sir. yes, ma'am. This person absolutely could be a baby mother. If not, they do want the whole enchilada with you. Um, this person's very emotional and they are in, they are grieving at this time. Uh, duh, a lot. Um, five of cups, four of cups, you bet your ass. This person, they, with the ten of cups, so four of cups, five of cups, this person, queen of cups, this person is grieving the loss of their entire everything. And I, I feel bad for this person. Um, they saw this very long term. This person could have been with somebody long term. They spied on this only per queen of cups, king of cups. They spied on the person they love. And they saw this relationship. They saw this person in union with someone else. Rumor has it, rumor has it, she has you. Honey, there's somebody here playing around with you. They are, um, you know, black magic, voodoo, hoodoo, hexes, curses, divination, abuses, very easily sent back once you know what you're dealing with. All you got to do is send it back. I declare and I decree. All black magic, voodoo, hoodoo, hexes, verses, curses, divination of use sent on God's servant, i.e. you. It's returned sender with light and love. That's it. That's it. Yeah. You know, this person does a lot of reading of the stars. Um, they have contacted many tarot uh, channels. They could be watching this. Um, the, that's kind of what I'm being told, that somebody here could be watching a lot of tarot, a lot of, uh, yes, and this person was a third party, yes, this person was a third party, they were a mistress, yes, was there a connection between you all, yes, was it a private connection, yes, it was, honey, this person is seeking the, scar the scars, the stars for karmic justice. They don't want you to get hurt. Now, they do have a fight with uh, the other party, which would be your wife or your husband. This person was a mistress. They're mad at you about that. You've caused them immense stress. This person doesn't want anything bad to happen to you but they do want to bend the will of the stars. The stars are in a challenged position. They want to bend the will of the heavens. And they're checking the progress regularly to see if karmic justice has paid off. This person might feel like they are high priestess or they, you know, they want to know if the high priestess that they contacted for this love miracle. Because this person signed up to go to war for this person, this magi this person contacted a magician to go to war for them, basically. Also, uh, this magician also could have guaranteed that anything um, that they were doing or paying for, this person was completely 100% protected from it. You're not going to feel the wrath of anything. I take all the heat, this magician. Um, I'm very well educated in spiritual practices, blah, blah, blah. Okay, then. I mean, maybe. <laughs> we'll find out, won't we? Because six of wands in reverse tells me it's not working. 
It's six of wands in reverse. It's not working. This is a sore fucking loser. They did not land it. Death in reverse. They refuse to accept it's over. Oh, my God. Ace of wands in reverse. They re Listen. It ain't working. It didn't land. Ace of wands is in reverse. The attraction is completely gone. Especially if you're dealing with a man, um, it's not attractive, and you've definitely pushed this man away. Uh, and I'm talking to a cross watcher at this point. Taurus, I don't think you're attracted to this person at all. This person could have legal issues as well. Uh, things are really resurfacing from this person's past. Um, that was a turnoff. There was a lot of turnoffs around this person. You looked into something. Uh, you could have saw something with their legal issues. That was a turnoff. Uh, this person could have been dealing with somebody else who was trying to, like, I don't know if they was trying to make you jealous. Like, they wanted you to fight for them or something with somebody that shit wasn't over with. You know what I'm saying? That was a turnoff. Um... This person, you definitely could have stepped out on your family, you know, had this, you know, um, a little side piece, you know what I'm saying? You treated her like number one. You were extremely masculine and you was going to let it ride as long as you, you know, was this death in, a, in reverse. It, it was kind of like, it, it was only going to be over until this person said it was going to be over. Until you looked into something, I don't know what you saw. It definitely could have been a legal issue. It definitely could have been something where you knew without the shadow of a doubt the minute you saw it, Taurus, the minute you saw it, it turned you off. It it was a major turn off to the point where your dick can't get hard. If I'm talking to a dude, hey, so one's in reverse. It, you completely lost all attraction. Um, whoever the magician is, the magician could be also guaranteeing these, like, to whoever lost this battle. They're guaranteeing this person that it's not over, that they're going to fight for them. That they're constantly checking the progress. And that slowly but surely, you, Taurus, are losing attraction for whoever your wife is or for whoever your husband is. <clears throat> We'll see if that's true. Whatever this was, it was all... Somebody here stepped out um, and had an affair. If not, this is when somebody was like on a small break or something. They did. This is somebody with a mistress. Most likely a man with a mistress, okay? It was all passion. By no means, stretch of the imagination, was this person number one, no. But this person was still put, putting out pussy. Like, at the end of the day, yo, you're dealing with men. If you're going to open your legs, what man, I, I cannot stress it enough to women out there. You have all the control. Uh, men do not see sex the same way women do. It is a biological, physical need for them. If they can get it, and you're going to give it for free and they don't have to pay a prostitute, cool. Nobody's going to find out, cool. This is somebody who had a quick moment of pleasure. Now, to the cross, cross watcher, I'm sorry if this hurts your feelings. But to Taurus, I'm, I'm not telling you anything you don't know. You did it, and that's okay. Like, I get it. I know people do this. This is real fucking life, after all. This person's trying to bend your wheel with the destiny. Um, death is in reverse. They don't want it to be over, even though you've most likely blocked this motherfucker. Repetitive. Not once, but twice. Eight of Wands, King of Wands makes the Nine of Wands. Here you are doing it again. How many times do you got to block this person? It's This person doesn't want it to be over. They feel like you are their destiny. Child, please. This person feels like y'all meant to be. You, you really gave them some good D or some good JJ. It was all passion. That's why I'm saying this. This person 
off of the good D, the good JJ. You are now their fucking destiny. Come on. This person could went to a palm reader type of witch. Okay. Mature man in reverse. Well, you did not act mature at all. Not in this, not in this scenario. Uh, I don't know. I think that you could be mature, but you had a, a lapse in judgment. You know what I'm saying? Like a lot of people do. Um, something was going on in your family where you just needed a little spice. This, I don't know, Taurus, I don't know why you stopped finding this person attractive. I don't know. Um, possibly because you're, you know, middle-aged and you have a family and you realize, like, I have to cut this person off. It's the right thing to do. And a part of you is no longer attracted to them. It's kind of like, okay, I don't know how else to say this. Say you're watching porn, and as soon as you get your nut, it's like, get that dirty shit off my phone. Get that dirty shit off my TV. Okay? Yeah, like you snap back to reality. The fuck? I'm a God-fearing man. I got a whole wife and kids that I love at home. The basically? I'm just letting you know this is what somebody's doing. Now, you know, I'm giving you the 411 on it so that you know somebody's playing the fuck around with you and your energy. You already know. You already looking at tarot. Uh, this person's a sore loser. Definitely a mistress that you, you stepped out with, bro. Most likely a dude. You know, I got the, the Knight of Cups. I got the King of Wands. It's all male energy. And I got your soft ass dick out here. That you are not a track. Uh -uh. You saw something. I don't know if you saw this person with the lights on. Because the star's in a challenge position. Maybe you just used to seeing this person in the dark. And the minute you got a glimpse of what they look like in the daylight. Oh, that dick went soft. That's how I really feel like how what happened here. Either way, be the way this person's trying to bend the wheel. <clears throat> bend the wheel of you. Um, unnaturally. You know. Maybe that's why you're watching the channel because you this person peeped you to you know spirituality. You know, they were their own catalyst, their own down. If that's what happened, they were their own downfall there because you don't found yourself here on this channel. And I'm exposing said little 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 thought packet here that done put up a little ten dollars, twenty dollars, fifty dollars to somebody. Um, you know, I've done told you how to, you know, I already told you how to send it back, baby. Okay. Mm -hmm. you better start accusing this person because it's her they want to make it clear it's this guy you see this this is an accusation she's done bidding your reading i don't know how many times it's this one right here see see this one this one it's probably a baby mother an ex-baby mother somebody who claims she the empress there's empress in a name somewhere Maybe she prissy. Maybe she's a something. Maybe her name starts with E. Maybe she's the third. Mm -hmm. Maybe she a third baby mama. I don't know. But this is the one right here. They want you to see. Maybe she looked like this girl on the card. Maybe she just thinks she all that in a bag of chips. Maybe she older. I don't know. But this person, they want you to know. This is most likely a baby mother. This this one. It's a big arrow. This one. This one. This the one. This one. And this is the one you need to send it back to. Accusations. Guilty verdict. Not a good reading. Not for this girl. Mm -mm. All right, Divine Masculine. I, I wholeheartedly believe I'm reading for a dude. Shit about to be ugly when you send that shit back. So go ahead and check on her. Because when you send it back, shit's about to pop off over there. Unfortunately, uh, this practitioner guaranteed results that uh, they knew damn well once someone told someone what was going on, this ship's about to pop off. 
Um, also, by the way, you could have a baby mother here that is about to really explode and really lose their shit, blow shit up in your, you know, blow shit up because this is like a whole tantrum. This person gonna have a whole tantrum. Mm hmm. Yeah. They, if they're gonna try to say it's over to kids or something. No, it's not over to kids. This person just wants to be a fucking thorn in your side and be competition and rivalry. That's all I can say. Definitely, this person is a baby mother that you do not want nothing left to. You don't want nothing to do with her. You left her out in the cold. Now, she's still going to throw you pussy from time to time. You go take it. That's on her. She's stupid. I'm sorry. Cross watcher. Um, I mean, I love you and everything. I love everybody, but you got to be you gotta be smarter than that, boo-boo, okay? Uh, whatever's between your legs does not keep a man. They don't. That's not the way to get a man to fall in love with you by giving out free pussy samples. That's not the way to do it anyway. Um, that's all I got. Take care.